beautiful love. So I've just got off the ferry now and I'm going exploring areas I've not been into until point before, heading towards the park. I've been on holiday, just talking all the way to you. Cause every fascination comes So Top Point is a civil parish town on the Rain Peninsula, southwest Cornwall. Do you like to say that Situated across from Plymouth, Mosley, like which is the Tiger Estuary on the River Tamar. Just up the river Tamar, you've got the third biggest naval base I'm in the so country, nuclear submarines. Cause I give you time and I give you That you take, the moves that you make. I've been to Toll Point before, but I've never been in this area. So swinging right, I'm just uh, doing a bit of exploring and see where I go. Deep within the lies every night. I see in your eyes what you fantasize all the time. I wanna hold you tight and make you see tonight. It's alright Cause I've been on holiday I was talking all the way to you Cause every fascination Comes with a price in your heart And I Give you time Cause I
You right? Hello, what's your name? I've just come to Tour Points and I, come, I came across you on the little causeway here. Yeah, I was drinking a coffee when you arrived, wasn't I? Yes. Um, yeah, my name is Linda. Yes. Um, and I retired down here to Tour Point about 10 years ago. Um, it took me quite a long time to decide exactly where I wanted to go. <laughs> Dock yards and warships. That proves we're near the sea. Yeah, and also the Navy base. <laughs> <laughs> the Navy base, yeah. Um, but I chose Tall Point because um, it's a nice, quiet little town. You don't get too many holiday makers here. Yes. Um, when they come off the ferry, they usually drive straight mm. through Tall Point. Yes. Uh, because they're going further down into Cornwall or they're going to the peninsula, the beaches, the cliff top walks, holiday accommodation. Yes. Um, so they just drive straight through, uh, and that's why I chose to live here. And you were uh, in social work before? Yeah, I was a community mm. care officer with social services. Yeah. Yes, in yeah. London? Uh, well, in Hertfordshire, actually. Yes. <laughs> so so yeah. you do a lot of walking around Tall Point, and you ref uh, sit by the water's edge and just reflect? Yeah, <clears throat> I, love, I love to get away. I'm a bit of an isolate, I suppose, really. Yeah. Um, and it's uh, it's nice here because you can actually get away from the madding crowd, as I call it, very quickly. Um, just just cross the, the the ferry from Plymouth and um, five fifteen minutes away. Yeah, that's right. Um, so uh, because we're on the peninsula here, we're surrounded by sea. Yes. Uh, which I love. I love to be near the sea. Yeah. Um, and I usually take myself off to the peninsula. There's two lovely little villages on the peninsula called King Sand and Core Sand. Yes. Um, and uh, I love to go down there and just have a little walk around. And then there's a coastal path that leads from Core Sand up to a place called Penley Point. Yes. And Penley Point is very beautiful. Yeah. Um, and then you can continue on from Penley Point and if you ca carry on along the coastal path there you get to Ramehead. Yes. Ramehead is another beautiful part. Yes. Um, it actually juts right out into the sea and there's a small very old church right on the end of uh, the head. Yes. Um, which you can get to. Um, everything's very up and down. Yeah, that's towards Whitsun Bay. Eh? That's towards Whitsun Bay, which uh, is yeah, a big well, surfing it's area. It's part of Whitsand. It's yes. part of the Whitsand Bay area. Yeah. Um, everything's very up and down, so um, you've got to be prepared to do a bit of climbing and a bit of... Yeah. And they've got ponies down there as well, haven't they? Yeah, they've got... I think they're from Dartmoor. Yeah, and they near bought, the head. And they bought the ponies. Um, it's to do with the environment. Um, I think the other thing is they actually keep the, um, the foliage and the grass down as well. Yeah. 
so um, but it, it helps with that. Yeah. yeah, and there's some good walks around Tall Point as well, isn't there? There's, you can walk around um, Tall Point, yeah. Um, I, you can actually walk from Tall Point to the small village of St John. Yes. Um, but it's a bit hairy if you meet traffic because the roads are so narrow yeah. that you've got to keep right in against the hedges. So uh -huh. I have done it once, but um, I haven't, I haven't uh, repeated that walk. Yeah. Um, but yeah, there's there's uh, walks around Tall Point, uh, but the main walks are actually on the peninsula. And uh, when I came into Tall Point last year, I discovered a nice little park. Yeah, the, the the park here. We're very lucky to have the park. It's called Thanks Park. How do you spell that? It's T H A N C K E S. Yes, S. S for sugar. You're right. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Thanks. Thanks. Thanks Park. Yeah, okay. And you get um, a lot of dog walkers going in there. Yeah. Um, they've got free range, they can let the dog off, they don't have to keep it on a lead. Yeah, I'll be going um, there to have a look at, in a minute anyway. Yeah, and it's um, it's a lovely wide open space that leads down to the edge of the water. Yes. Um, and again, it's not too busy. Yeah. So that, that's great. I love the escapism of it. The meditation. And the meditation. Yeah. It's... Um, it's a very spiritual place, I think. Yeah. Yeah. So we're going through the coronavirus problem at the moment in the UK and across the world. How, 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 uh, what do you think of it and how does it affect you? Um, well, I'm on my own. Yes. And um, I'm used to being on my own. I've been on my own for a very long time. Yeah. So being isolated isn't new to me. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I'm used to it. Yeah. Um, so it hasn't personally affected me that much. Yeah. Um, and um, I'm also a bit rebellious. Yeah. So I use my common sense. Yeah. And uh, if, a, if a particular situation doesn't seem right for me, yeah. to me, um, for whatever reason, then I won't put myself into that position, into that situation. Oh, that's survival. Um, eh? That's survival. Yeah, um, but um, I do. I, I know it has affected many thousands and thousands of people in this country. Yeah. Um, and we can't live a normal life because of it. And yeah. That is that is um, very sad, I think. But you can still. Um, but I mean, when you're by yourself, you can escape from it all because you can get out or into yeah. the country, away from the people and away from the news and everything. So yeah. you're well away from the virus yeah. and all the stresses that, that are put on the people as well. Yeah. And that's what I like about getting into the country. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. So yeah. I mean, I did lots of walking during the total lockdown. Yeah. Um, and again, because. We were uh, we were allowed to drive up to five miles outside of our area, weren't we? Yes. So uh, the peninsula is less than five miles from where I live. Yeah. So I took myself off out there quite a bit. Yeah. Um, I think the one thing that I really missed more than anything else was getting um, a coffee. Yes. <laughs> I used to love going and sitting in the local cafe for a coffee now and again. Yeah. And um, I miss that probably more than anything else. Probably more than my family, I've got to be honest. Oh, right, OK. <laughs> yeah, nice one. <laughs> so what's your name again? Linda. Linda. Nice, yeah. nice to talk to you, Linda. Yeah, thank you. Enjoy the rest of your meditation. Okay. <laughs> I'll leave you now and go and find what's, the park. What's your name? And my name's Chris. Oh, Chris, OK. Nice so, to meet you, So you Chris. can find me across YouTube. Yeah. Uh, thanks, thanks very much, anyway. That's all right. <laughs> well, that was a nice surprise meeting Linda. So I'm now heading up through Tall Point Village towards the park. So let's go. Thanks a lot, cheers.
Top End has quite a big park which I discovered quite a while ago. The top end is called Lawn Thorpe Park, the central point is Sparrow Park and the bottom end is Randall Park. It's always quiet there so it's nice to just reflect and sit and listen and look at the boats going past, looking at the naval base across the river. And Morris Town at the dockyards. It's to the end of today's walk and I'm in Thank Park which is in Tall Point which is the park I was on about. I was talking to a very nice lady called Linda um, who's been here for 10, been in Tall Point for 10 years and you've probably just seen the interview and uh, it's a really nice park very quiet uh, almost and um, relaxation time and then I'm heading back to Plymouth.
is uh, walk through the uh, town of Tor Point back to the ferry and um, it's been a great day, great afternoon. Well, it was quite a short walk um, but I've obviously made it long, long, a lot longer by uh, shooting video. Uh, so I hope you enjoy it anyway.
that's the end of today's great walk thanks for watching don't forget to subscribe to my channel the music on this video is great thanks by Chris Hobson you can find Chris on Facebook this has been a summertime TV international production of 2020 you can contact me at cc's photo one at gmail.com thanks for watching the video